Yo, what's going on guys? Shake and Bake back and today I'm gonna give you guys a quick video breaking down who is going to be tomorrow's Throwback Thursday team. They did the hints up on Twitter. I've only seen the first two. That's all I needed to see. I was able to solve the mystery. So let's get right into it. Now there are only four teams left. Yes, we go to the historic franchises and I will run through them really quickly. It is the Grizzlies. They still do not have uh, been released and in fact, I don't even know if it's possible to get Zebo. I don't think it is. I don't think those cards, those uh, what's it called, those freaking gold players have been in the game in the cycle yet at all. And then we go over to the next team that is still yet to be released, and that is the Mavericks. They still have yet to come out. Then we go to the third to last team, and that is the Pacers. The Pacers have yet to come out, but these cards have been in the game, and you can pull them through like the super packs, I think. And then the last team that has not been released is the Washington Wizards. Yes, and uh, I I'm not sure if you can get this card. I think you could. I think these were in super packs as well. Now, as for the actual hints, we're going to get into them right now. But the first hint had to do with a GM on a team, a former GM. And that's going to be Byron Scott, as you guys can see right in here. Byron Scott obviously coached the Lakers. That one's pretty easy. And then it was the second part of that hint said that someone in this team has also played for Team A. For Team B, it said. And now, first, I thought that was going to be the Mavericks. And I thought, okay, well, if we go over to the Mavericks right here, I thought it was going to be Mahimini because he played for the Pacers, I know, before he played for the Mavericks. But clue number two <laughs> actually broke it down even further. They said it includes two people of seven foot two or bigger. That's going to be Rick Schmidt and Roy Hibbert. Both are seven foot four and I think seven three. So that's pretty easy. It's definitely the Pacers. It's confirmed. None of these other teams have giant beasts like these guys do. I know the Mavericks has Sean Bradley, but they don't have anyone else that is uh, even close to them in size. So yeah, 6 foot 11 for Mahimini is probably the biggest one. Is Haywood a bit bigger than him? 7 foot he is, but still, I'm pretty sure no one else in this team is that big. Hey, 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 Wright's pretty big too, but still, not that big. And the second part of clue number two said you need two Rookie of the Award year winners. And I looked at the Mavericks and I was like, damn, all they have is Jason Kidd. I thought maybe, did Sean Marion win it? He didn't. Nobody else on this team has won a Rookie of the Year. But if you go over to the freaking Grizzlies, they've got not only freaking Pau Gasol who won it, but Mike Miller who actually won it, as you guys can see right here, Rookie of the Year. So they have the two and that fits with that clue. And then they also do have... Byron Scott as well, which I didn't notice. So it's going to be the Pacers and the Grizzlies. It's super confirmed. Now I ain't going to worry about that last clue, man. But yeah, those are the teams coming out. Pretty sweet, man, because I don't have these cards. So this is the perfect scenario. I said before, if we get these two teams, it works out perfectly for me, and we're going to get them. I'm not sure if uh, anyone over there was just trying to lend a hand, but if they were, thank you, because that, again, will be four new cards right there, plus the collection award is five, and then we go over to the Pacers, and it's another, as I just said, four cards plus five. That's ten new cards, and right now, I'm only about, I think, what? How many cards are we? 14 cards away, plus the event cards. That makes 12 Plus, 2K support owes me a couple of my two cards, my career cards. Two more, boom, Diamond Kobe. So if we complete both the sets and get both the event cards tomorrow in a pack opening, we will have Pink Diamond Kobe tomorrow. So be sure to leave a like on this video, man, if you guys are hyped for Throwback Thursday. I'm not sure who they can do for the players, to be honest. I have no clue. But pretty cool stuff. Those are the Throwback teams. Nice and quick and easy this week. And uh, yeah, next week's teams, the two weeks from now, will obviously be the last two, the Wizards and the Mavericks. But I hope you guys did enjoy the quick video, and uh, we'll see what they do with Throwback Thursday after this week. Peace, man.